about Casey's videos. This truly set the tone for the entire day, and if you think I'm kidding, just keep watching. Okay, so anyways, it is the third annual baking day, and this year we're calling it the Great Wisconsin Baking Show, because I'm Why personally not? obsessed with that show. The Great British one, not the one. You're not obsessed with us? No. <laughs> so, we are going hard this year. I'm personally going to attempt six recipes. I know. Oh, I, I didn't even family, tell them. I told my family nine total. How like, many are you making? Four. So, so ten. If everything goes as planned. Spoiler alert. It did not go as planned. It is currently a little after 10 a.m. 10 20. And we'll see how long this goes. <laughs> also, I bought liquid IV. If you wanted to try that, it's like a water thing. If you mix it with the water and it's like extra hydrating. I bought it as preparation so today we could like drink it and try it out. All right, so we're going to go. Let's get started. No. Um I'm going to try this. This is Emily. These ones are Emily. She has one more recipe on here too that isn't pinned. And then I'm going to make these. So, first we're going to try this one because I have tried macaroons before and I didn't have the right equipment and it did not work well. So we're gonna try again now that I have like better kitchen supplies. So this could be really fun or really bad. I'll let you guess which one it was. Bad. Apparently I'm supposed to use the pan like this. So reason number one, I'm afraid this isn't gonna work. One hour later. Um, I just finished sifting. Hope it was worth it. <laughs> it wasn't. All right, I'm gonna try this liquid IV for the first time, and I got the immune support tangerine one. They had a lot of flavors, but I thought immune support would be good for right now. It's very a lot stronger than I thought it would be. But it doesn't taste bad. Emily is famous. Chocolate peanut butter with crackers. Say what you could eat being YouTubers. Yep. These are so good guys. I just like how easy they are to make and then but yeah, they still taste good. And everyone and loves them. them. Yeah. They're like a crunchy Reese's peanut butter, basically. They're very good and easy to make. Messy, but <laughs> mm-hmm. white eat the egg white on medium low speed until foamy
enough to take a small amount of batter and drop it into the bowl. And if the peaks dissolve on its own in about 10 seconds, the batter is ready. Not ready. How is it gonna get runnier? Macaroons. Enjoy. They're not supposed to have little peaks on them. I really thought they were. Do I give up now? No. This is how not you, right. These are not going to turn out right. I'm, I can already tell. I give up. Like I'm. I don't want to bake them. There's no point. <laughs> I'm angry. Only good part of that recipe. Baking update. So this is what they look like. I mean, they kind of look like macarons. I think this one looks the most. The first one. I told you that I know. one was good. So we'll see how they taste. And then these are Emily's chewy gingerbread cookies. <laughs> and the chocolate covered Ritz crackers. The one that I literally took <laughs> All right, guys, we're moving on to the white chocolate dipped Oreos. Pretty excited. They're so cute. Let's hope these turn out a little better looking than the macaroons. pretty self-explanatory and my phone actually needs to be charged so I'm not gonna film me making the dough um, but I will show you like once the dough is done and everything so I can give my phone some time to charge these are delicious <laughs> Upon rereading the recipe, Emily discovered 
She forgot the flower. A whole three and a half cups of flour. So, that's what went wrong. Not the hot cocoa. <laughs> they say, as years go on, you get better at things. <laughs> I would like to say that this was our worst baking day in the history known to man. This was a true 2020 baking day. Let's just say we only have a few things that turned out right. Normally we have like a whole table full and um, we don't. Just things didn't go as planned and we ran out of stuff and we, we forgot, forgot stuff. stuff. In, in, in ingredients? Important ingredients. <laughs> <laughs> we only have a select few cookies that turned out okay. Moral of the story is cookies need flour. Macaroons are the dessert of the devil. Read instructions wisely. Three and a half cups. A flour is a vital, vital ingredient. Mm -hmm. Your cookies probably won't turn out right if you don't use flour. At least we know that now. And so do you guys, so you're welcome. Mm -hmm. And when you are sad, think of a tray of cookies. Jiggling. This was a big fail, so hopefully you found some of it entertaining and it won't be as much of a fail in that department. We are gonna go wallow in self-pity and we'll see you tomorrow. <laughs>